cranes arrived. We've got um, two cranes coming, this is the big one. And already it's uh, blown a gasket, so that's problem number one. Uh, so yeah, so we've got to bring a mechanic in to fix that. And uh, yeah, hopefully get that sorted so, so we get the crane. And here's number two just arriving now, I looked at that. I'm imagining hot rods, by the way. <laughs> like, All I'm doing <laughs> is like the world's biggest crucifix. That's all I've got a cream crane for. <laughs> I just don't want these to hit me in the face. Three puppets. What are you doing? <laughs> That's right, buddy. Once it lets go, it's going to fly up. Yeah. So if I don't want that steel and anything else and then tapping the um, bungee. So what we want is a four factor one which is basically you at the exactly same level as the bungee yeah. and if you are hanging on to that, that gives you full acceleration into this bungee. It's four factor one. Yeah, so that would be so eight now, meters of slack. Yep, that's yeah. exactly right. So you have an eight meter fall before the deceleration starts to kick in. Yeah. So now if I had three meters to the end, bottom of that, I've got to come three metres down from that, and so you get the same amount of fall factor onto that bungee, yeah. even though the bungee's going to be above it. Yeah? yeah. Kind of. Yeah. Sound confident with it, so it might have Best first test we've ever had. Did you have a watch? <laughs> Made a bit of a mess, mate. Need to get even better. Be nice. Still a long way to fall in it. That hell of a long way to fall. Good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, pretty bang. How close that? Yeah. Good. Oh, hey. that's perfect. So that, that is how many kilograms force is going through. So 236 kilograms of force going through my arms, technically. It's a lot here. Better? Yeah, still broken legs. Still ankles on that one. <laughs> 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 that's just like to a sit down cocktail. <laughs> 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 Stay off the floor. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Take number one. Well, the best thing about when you get just above these trees is not windy. If it was windy, that would like, yeah, it really pissed me off. It's not windy at all.
end of day two. We're going to wrap it up, I think, today. We went up there and it was way, way too windy as soon as you get to the trees. It's like going 70 miles an hour at the minute. And uh, yeah, as soon as we get them up there, it's just the weight bags going everywhere like that. So by the time we've um, you know, figured out the place where there's a lull in the wind, the weight bags still swinging around. So you don't know whether that's going to affect the thing or not. So we did it with a little bit of wind. Yeah, we're going to come back tomorrow, hopefully it's less wind and uh, you know, we'll get it on. I say we did it without the harness all strapped in, so we know it works. So, you know, tomorrow hopefully we go through the same process, get them done quicker and take this out of the way and put the airflow in and start tumbling. See you tomorrow. Apparently the main knuckle is stuck. They don't have knuckles. Got no hands. Peace. Get all the re remark everything and how did you say it should take us long. Damie Sand Walters. Damie Sand Walters. So strong. It's so strong, man. He broke the rings. He broke the rings. <laughs> what are the odds to do with that? So Joe, what are you doing? Filming him jump from a crane. Onto what? This mat. This mat? Yeah, that, look. It's quite hard. How will he do it, I hear you ask? I have no idea. Lash out at his bugs. Can you see a bug? What are you going to do? It's a dead bug. I can tell you that. <laughs> I'm not going to lie, arms are starting to go. Three, two, one, action! Did you get in? Go. And here we see Damien Wallace. Check it. 